I wanted to take an opportunity to provide my thoughts uh, and response to the governor's recently announced plan on the Transportation Trust Fund. And you know, to borrow a word from the governor, it, it is an unconscionable plan. Uh, it is a plan that does exactly what candidate Christie said we shouldn't be doing, which is kick the can down the road, uh, in this case, for five more years. Uh, the Transportation Trust Fund, when originally created under Governor Tom Kane, was a revolving plan um, in, a, in a much more cheaper period of time when the annual capital program was $400 million a year that was set up in a fashion like the NJEIT, the Environmental Infrastructure Trust, where the money would be bonded out over a shorter period of time and renewed over a period of time so that it was a revolving program. Over the course of two decades, uh, the debt schedule for the TTF has been extended time and time again from where we started out with 10-year bonds to now we're at 30 or 35-year bonds. And the, the borrowing continues unabated, including with this plan. The governor says that it calls for $4.4 billion in new borrowing. What that doesn't really take into account is that the money the governor talks about using for the turnpike is already borrowed money. It's $1.25 billion that was allocated for the <coughs> dark tunnel, and that was raised through toll money. And the money from the Port Authority is also borrowed money. So if you really want to look at this accurately, it is a trust fund program that is almost all borrowed money uh, and relies on a lot of assumptions that are not necessarily uh, assumptions that we can all agree will actually happen. For instance, relying on the Port Authority uh, to fund uh, some of our major transportation infrastructures is a plan that requires governors of two states to agree, not just one. It is a trust fund plan that will probably not stand the test of time. Um, you know, the governor talked about how this plan is going to create jobs. The, the ARC tunnel would have created jobs as well. The trust fund plan that we had in place created jobs. It's about making sure we have a trust fund plan that stands the test of time. And clearly, this is a trust fund plan that will stand the test of five years, if that, uh, but leave the state back in the same position it was at the beginning.